today we will discuss about view scale in Revit. First of all, I welcome all my friends on my educational channel. Subscribe it and press the bell icon for latest videos. Like and share also. The view scale is a proportional system used to represent objects in a drawing. You can assign a different scale to each view in a project. You can also create custom view scales. For better understanding view scale, we open a sample project. Open level 1 in floor plan and open floor plan sheet as well. Select tile view in view tab. So both views in front of us. This floor plan is dragged in this sheet. View scale tool is located in view control bar. The current scale of view is 1 ratio 100. We set it on 1 ratio 200 scale. View is adjusted in sheet according to scale. By changing view scale, annotation like grid bubble, text height keep same size and will not be affected. Let's see it closely again. By changing view scale, the presentation of view will change, element size will never change. The dimension from grid A to B is 3000 and if we change our view scale, it will never change. You can also add custom scale instead of these default scales. Select custom in the top of the scale list. Add a custom scale of 1-90. By keep unchecking display name, it shows the same scale on view control bar as scale shows. If you want to assign another name of view scale on view control bar, just check display name and write anything what you want to display on view control bar. You can also do this procedure in sheet by right clicking on view and selecting active view tool or click on view and select active view tool in modify tab select your desired view scale in view control bar we can set different view scales of different views in one sheet it is not necessary that all views in one sheet have same scale which view scale we set in view control bar it displays same as in properties palette we can also change view scale through properties palette by selecting custom scale we can increase or decrease view scale through up and down arrows keys so it is over today's view scale topic I hope you understand and like it. For more educational videos, keep watching BIM Talks.